This is the Bering 70. She has a length overall of 22.43 meters, a beam of 5.58 meters, a displacement of 64.8 metric tons, and a range of over 2,500 nautical miles. She has accommodation for six guests and two crew. As the explorer and expedition yacht market grows, more and more people are interested in these capable boats. This is excellent news for people like you and me, who have always been interested in these type of boats. The Bering 70 has a cruising speed of 8 knots, with a maximum speed of 10 knots. If you are happy to motor along at her cruising speed, then she will take you, your family and your friends over 2,500 nautical miles. And best of all, she has been rated as CE Category A, meaning that she has been built specifically to cross oceans. The long and sleek profile of the Bering 70 is unmistakable, from her inverse inclined bow right through to the elegant and low profile aspect of her superstructure. The Bering 70 oozes sophistication, seaworthiness and comfort. When you step inside this magnificent yacht, you are met with modern and clean unobstructed lines, which help to create a sense of comfort and a sense of coziness. As you battle through the big seas, these internal areas become your serenity, as the watertight doors and bulkheads give you the peace of mind, which genuine seafarers like myself who are willing to go out in rough conditions crave. Just look at these watertight doors. How many luxury yachts can boast features such as this? The bearing range of motor yachts is one of a handful of boat builders I would trust to take my young family and me through some gnarly conditions. The communal areas on the Bering 70 are inviting. As you cruise through the colder climates, these areas provide the sort of refuge that your soul will crave. Bering's use of indirect lighting genuinely makes my soul smile with delight. The wheelhouse and helm station on the Bering 70 provide all of the vital information you need right at your fingertips. Nestled in the display is a repeater image of the engine room, a central peace of mind when you are cruising single-handedly. Meanwhile, the switches are expertly laid out. Everything you need, 
is within arm's reach. At the heart of this Explorer yacht is a twin 305 horsepower Cummins QSB 6.7 engines. These are what will take this full displacement steel and aluminium boat to a maximum speed of 10 knots. When it comes to the layout of the Bering 70, this is the upper view. Here is the flybridge where you can fit a 3.4 meter or 11 foot tender. Next we have the main deck, followed by the accommodation below deck including the crew quarters on the stern. Ever since I first heard of Bering, a few years after they launched, I've been a big fan of their naval architecture and overall design. One of the great things about the Bering 70, owing to her shallow draft of 1.33 meters or 4 foot 4 inches, is that she is just as well suited to shallow coastal waters as she is suited to long range ocean crossings. And that is just one of the many features about the Bering 70 that I love. I hope you enjoyed my video. Let me know in the comments what you think of this particular bearing model. Don't forget to give the video a like and to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Hopefully in the not too distant future, I can shoot some footage of board of bearing. If you are interested in becoming a member of my channel, then I will put a link up now where you can find some information about some of the perks which channel members can get. So until next time, fair winds and following seas.